Oh, Kittlehelma fans! Hello again! My name is Harry James. Again, Oklahoma follower. Oklahoma super fan. Uh, this next game that we're going to break down will be senior night, senior day. Uh, will take place on October the 16th of 2013, where we will play the Iowa State Cyclones. The Iowa State Cyclones are coached by Ames native Paul Rhodes. Last year took them to a 6-7 and seven record, 3-6 and six in the Big 12 Conference, just finishing the, in ninth place, just above Baylor. Uh, their bowl game last year was the Auto City Liberty Bowl, and it was a 31-17 loss to Tulsa. Um, offensively, uh, players that will be missing this team still Jans is no longer with this team. He had a 1,603 yards in the air last year, uh, 13 touchdowns, 43 was his longest pass. And it was uh, the Tulsa game, the opener, the non-conference game, not the bowl game. Uh, defensively was A.J. Klein, a buck 17 tackles, one interception, zero forced fumbles, and zero fumbles recovered last season. And all that was through the Oklahoma game. Uh, the, he did not participate in the Oklahoma game, nor in the games afterwards. Uh, offensively, the players that are coming back to this team, Sam Richardson had 541 yards passing, eight touchdowns, 69 was his longest, it came in the Liberty Bowl against Tulsa. Uh, his running backs that are going to help him out a lot, uh, one of them is named James White. He had 99 carries last year for 505 yards, two touchdowns. 56 was his longest. He came up with that one against Western Illinois. His other running back out there will be Chantrell Johnson. He had a buck 15 carries last season, 504 yards and two touchdowns. He had a long of 19 yards. He did that twice. He did it against Baylor Bears. And he get it against our Oklahoma Sooners, both in Ames. Wide receivers helping Sam out will be Ernest Brown Jr. Jr. had 26 catches last year for 303 yards and six touchdowns. His longest was the, a 69-yarder against Tulsa in the Liberty Bowl. Uh, Jarvis West will be the other key receiver out there. He had 31 catches last year for 290 yards. Three touchdowns, 23 was his career long, and it came against the University of Baylor. Uh, defensively, uh, this is where Paul Rhodes loves to play. Uh, not a lot of Big 12 teams play defense. Uh, Oklahoma, we like to say that we do, but we came up with a lot, a lot of chunk yards against uh, West Virginia. We gave up a lot of yards to Oklahoma State. These guys didn't give up a whole lot of yards a lot. Uh, Helping them out was uh, one guy was Jerkwitz Washington, who had 91 tackles last year, two interceptions, zero forced fumbles, zero fumbles recovered. Also, Jeremiah George was out there. He had 87 yard, 87 tackles, zero picks, forced fumble, and zero fumbles recovered. As I said, this is going to be senior night. Uh, if you're looking for a key guy. Uh, this is an interesting step that you might not have known. Uh, Richardson, who had 541 yards last year, eight touchdowns and 69 was his longest, uh, the Tulsa uh, against Tulsa in the Liberty Bowl. His mom is Dot Richardson. Uh, she called a lot, a majority, I'm sorry, of our uh, OU softball games this year. She is down in Florida now. She is also a part of the uh, Team USA softball, former Team USA softball member. So this so this guy is going to be a guy to watch out for. Uh, he's your guy that if you just want one guy to key on, this is your guy. Watch out for this guy. He's uh, 
a collegiate athlete. Uh, so just watch out there. Other than that, everybody enjoy it. This is going to be the final home game. Uh, you got two more games coming up, though. Oklahoma State and Kansas State. We'll break those down here later on. Till then, everyone take care. And as always, Boomer Sooner, everybody.